to Duke and welcome back to my channel if you're new. My name is Cassandra and today I'm just going to be sharing with you guys some really easy kids lunches. I'm also going to show you guys a couple of my lunches and things like that. Some budget friendly things that we're doing heading into the summertime just to give you some ideas, maybe help you switch it up a little bit. Lunch today is definitely a mod podge. I just pulled out a ton of leftovers and different things. We spent all day yesterday at barbecues and different things like that. So we have a lot of leftovers, things that are just kind of left over from later last week that we needed to use up. So I had some leftover grilled cheeses. I already handed some out for the kids, but I also just made a fresh batch of the tomato soup. This is our favorite tomato soup. We get this from Aldi. It's a little bit more expensive than your traditional tomato soup, but man, it's good. And this can is huge. It's 18 ounces, so it's a little over a pound of soup, and it is so good, you guys, so good. I, I cannot recommend this enough. This Simply Nature brand is really good. I love it. So tomato soup to go with the grilled cheeses. I also have some leftover Sloppy Joes that came home from a barbecue. Uh, we've got some cheese curds here, fresh from the cheese factory. We picked these up two days ago. I have a big thing of bologna here and some sliced cheese, and then... They could do lettuce or uh, mustard, mayo, you know, the typical sandwich fixings, obviously a loaf of bread here. And then I also pulled out some cheese whips. These are like string cheese, but these things are massive. They're like over a foot long. We got these from the cheese factory too. But some of them are like shorter whips and some of these things are just massive. Let me see if I can find one here. Here we go. Here is like one of those massive whips. So they're really fun, the kids love these. So we've got some cheese, a lot of cheese happening today, but I'll also pull out some applesauce as well, but just kind of like a leftovers buffet happening. You want more cheese, here you go, bud. Oh, you guys shared? Okay. <laughs> today for lunch, we're doing non pizzas. Two of these are pepperoni, the other three are just cheese. These are for the kids, and whatever's left over here, my husband will be more than happy to bring with him for lunch tomorrow. And then I also have three Supreme styles in the oven right now, still kind of going. Uh, onions, mushrooms, bell pepper, pepperoni. That's for me, that's what I prefer. My kids, not so much, so I made a couple for myself. Like I said, if I have leftovers, there'll be a great snack tonight after the kids go to bed or uh, lunch over the next couple of days, whatever. So, eight non pizzas are for lunch today and then we will either pair these with things like baby carrots, grapes, apples, oranges, uh, applesauce, but if the kids just want pizzas, they'll just eat pizzas. I always try to throw some fruit or vegetable on their plate. Sometimes they don't want it. It's, it's okay. My kids eat very healthy, I think, in my opinion. They are always eating different fruits and vegetables and stuff, so if they don't want them today, that's totally okay but I'm still gonna try to squeeze those on there, just so you know what we could be doing for sides with these pizzas. What I'm doing for lunch today, it's just me and my two kids who are home with me today. We keep these boxes of soup on hand, like multiple of them, because when we're sick, this is what we tend to gravitate to, but I pulled out one of these. Everyone got a bowl of soup, and then I also had made some bread. I go grocery shopping today, but it was pretty scarce, we completely ran out of bread, so I made two loaves, and I just cut up the rest of the one little piece of bread we had left over from the first loaf, put it in the oven with just a little bit of mozzarella cheese. These melty cheese toast things, the kids really love them, we just call them cheesy breads. Really simple, cut these in half, my kids will eat probably one half of a piece with their soup, and that's what we're having today for lunch. So very simple, very easy, and very minimal cleanup as well, which is always nice. Today for lunch, the kids are just eating SpaghettiOs. I like to keep a couple of these in the pantry just for easy lunches. Do you need help opening that? And then they're also having a string cheese with their SpaghettiOs, so that's just gonna be lunch today. I'm eating some leftover chicken salad from last night, and then I think I'm gonna pair it with some applesauce, and then Probably something else because I'm starving today. I'm so hungry. So I'm gonna find something else to pair this with. I don't know what it's gonna be, but applesauce and this for sure. To day for lunch, we're doing cheese raviolis with some leftover spaghetti sauce that I froze and just thawed. So it's really good, great tomato sauce. 
And then uh, just some pieces of butter toast or like garlic salt. Some of us put garlic salt on our toast. Some of them are just eating plain buttered toast, but this is lunch today. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope this video was helpful for you guys or entertaining in any sort of way. I'll link down below videos that I think you guys would care to watch. Seen and I'll see a lot of change, been through a lot of pain. Some things are not the same as they were a year ago. But all will be okay. I move on each and every day. The past is where it stays.